streets to the Ikhlasnia Primary School in Beacon Valley remain closed after a shooting claimed the life of 12-year-old Firdos Glainsmith. She was playing with her friends behind these trees on the school's premises when a bullet hit her. Her family is in shock. She was very special. She was a special child. <laughs> Lots of love for everybody. She was very shy, didn't like showing emotion. <laughs> but we knew that what was in the heart. Activists are demanding police visibility and that more be done to fight the worsening crime in the community. The Community Policing Forum is urging parents not to protect their children who are involved in criminal activities. What we want to see in our communities is doors being kicked off, doors being bashed in and to search not just for guns but for all people doing crime and criminality and that is far in between. Apologies and condolences is no longer accepted. Community also can come out in numbers and stand together and say my child is your child and your child is my child and say that my child break into that person's house and come forward and bring that child to so that we can put him through the books. And the Muslim Judicial Council has called on Police Minister Peggy Tele to step in to stop the violence on the Cape Flats. We're appealing to the Minister of Police. Please, sir, you hold the position. You have the resources. You need to do something here. We are appealing to our local government. You have the resources. Stop the infighting because we are dying on the streets. Our children are dying on the streets. No arrests have been made in connection with Ferdos's killing. Nobesutu Ejana, Cape Town.